We bring to your attention the important matter of job security for lecturers and senior lecturers at Wayne State University. In the last seven days, we have gathered more than 800 signatures and a public petition protesting the mass notices of non-renewal to all lecturers and senior lecturers up for renewal this year. Among the lecturers that have been effectively fired include faculty who have won this university's highest teaching awards. This practice is happening at units across campus. To give you a sense of the scale, consider, for example, that 38% of all lecturers and senior lecturers in the College of Liberal Arts and Sciences were effectively fired. Maybe. Depending on a budget decision in April, or May, or perhaps even June. Depending on when we even get a budget. This is too late for anyone to find a new job for the next academic year. We are going to lose talented faculty because we can't make timely budget decisions. More importantly, this practice of mass maybe firing demeans the professional contributions of lecturers and senior lecturers to the research, teaching, and service profiles of their departments. Lecturers are 12% of all full-time faculty, but they teach 20% of all enrollment at this university, including courses taught by other full-time faculty, part-time faculty, and GTAs. Of the tuition money raised by lecturers, about $11 million goes to our salary. The other $34 million goes to the college, university, and a bloated administration. Lecturers are the wrong target for budget cuts. President Wilson, your administration has developed a well-polished marketing machine. But if we don't support our teachers in the quality of education, we will have nothing worth selling. President Wilson, we call on you to take action and to rescind these notices of non-renewal and to restore dignity and professionalism to our lecturers and senior lecturers. Let us teach. Woo